Here's an example of visual odometry using a Kinect sensor. The Kinect provides both a color image and a depth image. In the depth image, cooler colors are closer and warmer colors are farther away. This type of sensor is known as RGBD. Visual odometry is a problem where the camera's ego motion is estimated by tracking features throughout a video sequence. When I switch the right view to the 3D um, image, you can see the path it is estimating clearly. The visual odometry algorithm being used here works by tracking features in the color image and then using the depth image to estimate their 3D pose relative to the camera. The camera's pose can then be updated iteratively by examining how those features move. Visual odometry with a RGBD sensor is much easier than it is for stereo, both computationally and algorithmically. On the left, you can see how fast the motion calculation is happening. It fluctuates between about 80 and 120 frames per second. One issue that you need to be careful about is motion blur. This is especially problematic inside dimly lit rooms. You can mitigate this issue by switching to a different type of tracker, as I did here, because KLT, the tracker which I've been using throughout most of this video, is um, prone to failure when motion blur is present. The downside to using these other trackers is that they tend to operate much slower. Um, for example, this one is running at about 30 frames per second right now.